、俺の顔が縦長なんだよ。あ、なるほどね。<笑>顔でかいから、ね。<笑>トリミングスのスリムになる。あ、no, we are not gonna talk about, あ、uh, I mean, we are not playing game today. こいつじゃダメだ。向こう画面を全体に動かせるよね。向こう画面を全体に動かせるチャットボックス。マフェイス。ちょっと待ってね。<笑>チャットで顔が隠れるどうしようかこれチャットをあれ、それ、それ、メネツラフトまあ、この辺にあればいいか一応ちょっとあ、ひとこさん今日お休みなんで。Yes, no, stop her here. She have to take care of her. すごいチャットでアドバイスしてますけど。いや、ちょっとね、よくわからない。<笑>まあ、いいっすよ、いいっすよ。遠くメインなんで。うん、まあね。Who cares about the camera? We just gonna talk. 向こう画面全体でもよくわからない。ヤングニカドオーナー若い頃のニカド店長みたいって言われてますけどあそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそうそなんか、それはあれだな。あ、でも大丈夫だよ。思ったら。多分、okay. ネットワーク的な問題だね。OK。There we go.Alright.Ah,、uh, let's get started.Um, <笑><笑> as you know, we have a secret guest.It's him. <笑> I'm just kidding. This is episode <laughs> 136 of Cable TV. Okay, he's in. Yay! <laughs> SMC, my guy. <laughs> Good seeing you here. Okay, let's get started. Yeah.、Um, for Japanese people,、uh, please introduce yourself. Yeah. So, yeah, for、uh, my introduction. <laughs> I'm a Atari Ultra. Oh my god, it's us! You're s u s t g Oh my god! Thank you for watching. Yeah, thank you for watching, people. Yeah, and yeah, I'm a Atari Ultra player.、Mm-hmm. I do 1.01, and、uh, right now I'm doing 1.5. I play 1.01 at、uh, AGDQ. And,、uh, and、uh, 1.5, I've done a counter stop clear in the past, but、uh, I figured out a method to kind of like、uh, count your score over the counter stop. So,、mm-hmm. I'm back at, at that 1.5 ultra grind. Back at trying to up my score. Yeah. That's, that's pretty much me. <laughs> Atari Ultra. So, there's like two guys who once they say、uh, 1.01 yeah. That, Ultra. A, yeah, that second guy is Rescue STG. Man, he's also the only dude who's done a 1.5 with normal palm. Oh. Yeah, he, he, he's the king of this mold. So. <laughs> Everyone's here. Yeah. <laughs> Every super player is here. Yeah. Okay.、Um, I want to ask you、um, how does it happen about、uh, AGDQ?、Um, you know, it's an RTA event and it's not、uh, so suitable for R- RTA, the Mushihime and the Shurema stuff. So, how does it that happen? Well, Like for a long time in the community, like we kind of been skeptical of AGDQ. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. we've been thinking, like they're never going to accept us. You know, if we got accepted, it's not going to make a difference. 
So yeah, I, I even didn't really like to think much was gonna happen when I registered. I didn't even expect him to pick me. <laughs> but like the reason why I registered was, was like my mom kept asking me to register. Like uh, <laughs> she was a little bit skeptical that stunt fest run at first. Like she was, oh. I told her, oh man, I'm gonna be do, playing doing a, playing my, my game in France. It's, it's gonna be incredible. And like she thought, what, what are you talking about? This is a scam. <laughs> but then like she actually watched it and she loved it a lot. So she kind of like encouraged me like register for AGDQ. And uh, yeah, eventually I just registered to get, because I got tired of her asking me to do it. So your work friend got the watch show? Uh, Stunfest. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's your play that Stunfest? I played both 1.5 and 1.01. Oh. Okay, so that's cool. All right, uh, nice. Okay, why do you play Futari? Why do you choose uh, Futari? Yeah. Tell me about it. I love the, the difficulty. Love the <laughs> you love the difficulty. <laughs> yeah, I love the scoring system too. You know, it's just brutal simplicity, basically. Get those big cancels, be aggressive getting those gems. Oh yeah, big juicy cancel. Yeah, that's <laughs> what it's all about. Big juicy cancel. What? How does big juicy council come from? Is that Aquas from Aquas? Yeah, we did a we did like a test run, mm -hmm. and uh, him and Potashu they found that like <laughs> they were saying the word juicy a lot, <laughs> and I wanted some some memes to come from my uh, run, so I told him, hey, say juicy as much as possible, <laughs> make it a meme. So you said that How about the juicy stuff. Mm. Well, I pushed him to say it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so, well, you said it, but uh, what is your next goal about the yeah. shoot em up? Right now, I'm working on, uh, on 1.5 yeah, yeah. Ultra, and uh, my goal right now is uh, 4.5 billion. That's kind of my short term goal. Mm -hmm. And my long term goal is I want to one day get a uh, 5 billion in it. Yeah, it's a pretty hard goal to beat. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. This guy named Chubo, he, he used to help me out mm -hmm. with uh, that mode, and uh, one day he just claimed I got five billion. I, I don't know if I believe it because, like, he never showed me the replay or any sort of screenshots. No, but uh, it, it's it's a it's a nice goal, nice round number. <laughs> um, are you going to play as a shooter map, or you just focus on the story? I'm interested in uh, USD, definitely USD. Uh, Komakyo, you know. Ah, it's a Toho. Yeah, Toho Six, mm -hmm. Bottom Man of Scarlet Devil. Yeah, I, like even right now, that's a fun game. Just kind of like boot up and uh, grind some of those hard sections because like there's just so much RNG in it. It's like a little bit different every time you play it. Mm -hmm. so it's a real fun game just to like uh, play a little bit and you know move on to something else. <laughs> But yeah, it would be great to kind of like uh, learn to score that one someday. And uh, I also like to uh, play Power Roomy. Power Roomy, oh yeah. yeah. Power Roomy, that game is fantastic. Maybe we should play Power Roomy someday. Yeah, that, on that's that streaming. That's one of the best games to come out of uh, out of the indie scene, I think. Mm -hmm. Okay, so next. Uh Tell me what you feel on the thinking about the uh, Western <laughs> community, uh, Western shoot em up communities and the Japanese shoot em up community. Um, what is the difference? Well, Do you feel the difference? Yeah, like the Japanese community mm -hmm. is predominantly offline. You know, oh, yeah. all front, yeah. Yeah, like people, they, they kind of like meet each other in the arcades mostly. They yeah, play yeah. in the arcades. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's not really like the Western community mm -hmm. where like yeah. it's all online mostly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's really the key difference there. Like like even the term Western, mm -hmm. that's not really a, a right that's name, I think. Mm -hmm. Like there's no rule that like you have to be like from the West to participate <laughs> in the Western community. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's not like the JHA where like they got that rule or in order to like submit a score you have to like play the Japanese arcade. Mm -hmm. We have nothing like that. Like we don't even say like Western record anymore. Oh. Instead, we say community record because oh, we want to yeah. get, get scores from people who uh, aren't from the West involved. Well, I I think it's kind of the same in Japan now. People don't know what the uh, world record is. They don't. 
I don't think so. In some games, mm. some title. So. Oh my God! It's SPE. <laughs> <laughs> don't want to see some. Don't show up. I see everyone's here. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, um, we got a question from Japanese guy. Um, how wrong do you play Mushi Hime Song of Dari? How wrong did you practice? Well, I've been playing it since uh, 2011. <coughs> oh, yeah, I don't, I don't really know how many hours <laughs> I played. So you, nine years. Yeah, it's a it's a lot. Don't you get tired of it? No. No. <laughs> oh. That's very good. Yeah, doesn't really get old. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, the world records, they are usually in a JHA. JHA? Yeah. You know JHA? I don't know. You know what well, well, I, I know, but uh, tell it to the people. Oh, yeah. Well, like since the 80s, there was this magazine that kind of like tracked all the world records yeah, yeah. called Gamist. Gamist. And then that magazine shut down mm -hmm. and it got replaced by this one called Arcadia. And that run had a good run for like 20 years. Yeah. Then back in like 2015, it shut down again <laughs> and it got replaced by GHA. Mm. Yeah. And yeah, that's really where we stand right now. So, um, Western communities uh, use GHA? Yeah, they. Do you guys what? Look at? Yeah, they, they look at it. We use pretty much all sources, really. Mm -hmm. Like we look on Twitter, we look on GHA, and yeah, we look on our own scoreboards because you know Western players they do actually have a few world records. I mean, but we got them, so we kind of like we compile from all sources, but pretty much, yeah. Uh, and, uh, this? Do you guys have any question for him? Yeah. How much time we got? We still have right. Damn. 20 minutes. 20 minutes. We got 20 minutes. There you go. Oh, okay. <clears throat> so, yeah, what, yeah, it says here, what do you want from the Shmup? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. What you want yeah. from, for Shmup community oh, yeah. or from us. Yeah, I'd like to use communities to kind of like get, get closer together, you know? Yeah. yeah. That's something I've been pushing for for a long time. That's sweet. To yeah. kind of like cooperate a little bit more. Like, uh, there's that language barrier, of course. Yeah, 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 of course. But, like, I think even, like, the bigger thing is this whole thing with, like, strategy hiding. Yeah, like, strategy yeah. hiding. Yeah, 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 I know that. Yeah, it, it's really weird. A lot of Western players, like, even myself, we don't really, like, fully understand it. Mm -hmm. Like, pretty much any time that we, like, talk to a Japanese player, like, we don't know, like, if we're kind of, like, violating someone's spoken rule. Because, yeah... It, it's really hard to understand like some guys they're real open about sharing things but then other guys they share a little bit and then other guys are just totally private mm -hmm. yeah I think it's kind of the offline thing you said mm -hmm. yeah so you want people to get like not hiding stuff more well it would be nice if we could just like talk out in the open oh about why they're yeah, doing yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah yeah that's gonna be good yeah, I think like like a lot of Westerns, like they're terrified of like even like just asking, hey, how do you do this section? Or like, hey, can I get a replay? Mm -hmm. Because like they're scared of like maybe they'll offend somebody if they do that. Yeah, it would be nice to kind of get a more open dialogue mm -hmm. about that mm -hmm. sort of stuff. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, it's, it's not really like even like just the problem of like the people doing this strategy hiding. Like the Westerners, like uh, sometimes they'll kind of like a little bit dishonest yeah, about it. Yeah, yeah. Like there's this one time like WTN, he gave a video of the 1-5 chain in Don Pachi to like this one Western player was like, this is a secret. You're not supposed to share it with anyone. <laughs> and that guy, he did share with it somebody. And that guy, he shared with more people. Mm -hmm. And now it's up on YouTube publicly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think we should probably be a little bit more mature about this whole situation, mm -hmm. really. <laughs> Oh, oh, yeah, that's what I wish for, pretty much. We have a question. Uh, do you think you can beat Imbachi? No. No? <laughs> okay, no. <laughs> he said no. Uh, 
Mm. Look at the video still. <laughs> 15 minutes. Mm? Yeah. What's we gonna talk about? Nako, what I told you. What I told you? So, what you have played in Japan right now? Well, well you don't play? Well, hey, or Picado? Did you play something? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I had that great meet with uh, Bikini that you were at too, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. I was there. I watched uh, Piketty and uh, Kayar have a race for uh, the top side I owed to score. And it, was, yeah. it, was, it was insane. Yeah, real glad to have seen it. But uh, yeah, I can't really play with too well in Japan because I'm, I'm not going yeah. with an arcade stick. Why are you playing with uh, game, gaming pad? That's just what I grew up using. <laughs> yeah. Game, Guru Game Boy, what helps you most when you were learning to rap through shooters? Definitely uh, having replays, having practice mode. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those are what helped me out. And uh, yeah, I also want to do a little bit of sh do a little bit of shilling for my boy Kiwi. He's gonna be promoting. He's gonna be uh, submitting Mushi Ultra One, the first game, to a GDQ oh, yeah, 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 yeah. at uh, SGDQ uh, back in June. Yeah, it's gonna be tight. This dude, he, he's sick as hell. Definitely, uh, definitely tune in to watch him if uh, his game gets accepted. Also, my boy Mark MSX. Mark MSX. Yeah, he's yeah. been on that late night grind, pumping out tons of YouTube content on his channel, The Electric Underground. Mm -hmm. And yeah, he's gonna be submitting Zero Ranger. So uh, yeah, he's a pretty good player as well. He's got two all of Dodon Pachi. Do oh, Dodon oh, do Pachi. Dodon Pachi. Dodon Pachi. Okay. Yeah, he grinded for a year straight to get it. Are you gonna? Show up again on the GDQ. Are you thinking about it? Yeah, I'm thinking about it, but uh, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna play. I'm thinking I have Resolute Two or Futari God mode. I don't want to like do Ultra again. <laughs> They've already seen it. And yeah, okay. yeah. Masamune Shadow. How much of the uh, 1.01 did you have to route yourself, or was it mostly 1.0 or 1.5 strats? Well, nobody's really routed 1.0 as far as I know. Yeah, yeah. So like uh, 1.01 stage five, that one is totally different from a 1.5 ultra stage five. Mm -hmm. I had to like make the route entirely on my own. But then like the rest of the mode, it was kind of a combo of like uh, strats and like I saw in like RSQs, clear, like for stage three. That he was real helpful with like learning how to uh, do that. He was like that part's missing some bullet cancels. And uh, there was also some older like strats in like 1.5 that I worked on with Chubo that uh, I really wanted to like incorporate. Like those stage four moths. That was something that I really wanted to like uh, figure out. So how was, how is the cave? You're actually here. Yeah, it's amazing. <laughs> Yeah, that, that feeling when I walked through those doors, I saw that Ikeda statue. Yeah, statue, yeah. Man, you can't describe it. Just the excitement. <laughs> Felt like a jolt of electricity on me, man. That was incredible. <laughs> man. He's so excited. Yeah. How about it? Yeah. Man, even now it's, it's like a dream, <clears throat> man. I can't believe I'm here. <laughs> Man. You made that dream come true. Yeah. My friend in AGDQ, you're like hero now. You're a great, great Man. guy. Yeah. Man, I, I, can't, I can't believe it's happening, dude. <laughs> yeah. You got a question? Yeah, we got a question on it. What? I gotta check the question. How long have you been playing the you know, Shur Shurema as a channel? Since, uh, since 2010. 2010, so. Yeah. It's a 10 years anniversary in your yeah. brain right now. Yeah. 
Yeah, my, my first uh, clears, there were uh, one all of Donpachi and Donpachi. I really love Donpachi. I think it's uh, a program that's streaming. <coughs> is it working? Is it? <laughs> Can you guys? So, um, tell me about the difference between the Western Japanese, um, what should I say? Environment, a little well, frame. Uh, like I was talking about, the big differences of strat hiding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like it, it seems like a, like a big cultural difference too. Like if you're, like, I think like Japanese players like they don't really react to it negatively. Mm. Like if you ask, hey, can I do this? And, and you say like, oh, I'm sorry, I can't tell you, it's a secret. <laughs> like, yeah, it's no big deal, right? Mm. <laughs> it depends on the yeah. people, but. Uh, yeah. Mm. Yeah, but but yeah, in, in America or like in the West, I should say, yeah, that is a big deal if you like refuse to help somebody. Like a lot of Westerners, like they'll take that personally if you don't want to like tell them something. Yeah, and yeah, it's seen as like a, a really bad thing, like for the long term health of the game. Like if all the best strats are kept top secret. So yeah, like that Dodo Pachi glitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a lot of Westerners, it just plain drives them crazy that they don't know the glitch. But I, I get the impression to a lot of Japanese people, it's like not too big a deal, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What should I say about this? <laughs> hey, hey, we are uh, hey, hey streaming. Truxton too. This is you, da da And somebody asked about some Casper piss bottles. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. He told me that they're uh, that they're expired now. Yeah, it's it's oh, expired. Yeah, I, I asked if I could have one, and yeah, <laughs> no. it'd be nice yeah. if they kind of like resume production. <laughs> well, Moji Love, yeah, yeah. I think the the key the key thing is just kind of like do what I said before, like be more open, be have more a more open, open dialogue. Mm -hmm. about like strat hiding, replay hiding. Mm -hmm. Don't just like treat it as a taboo subject because I get the impression right now it is a taboo subject. If you like ask a Japanese player, just flat out, hey, can you give me a replay of this secret store? Like, hey, why are you hiding replays? It's not really something that like okay to talk about, I think, but uh, it'd be nice if it's not such a taboo thing, if we could like have more adult, uh, open discussion about this stuff. Well, um, you know, it was offline and like back back in eighties or nineties. Yeah. So I think it's kind of changing now. Yeah. About the uh, hiding stuff, mm -hmm. you know, people got the internet. Yeah. Yeah. I I guess it's just kind of the, a few games where there is strat hiding, it, like yeah, in yeah. the rest of the scene of bad rap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Question, we got a question. Oh, yeah. What is your next goal? He said, yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, he's, his goal was 1.5 good runs, right? Yeah. Yeah. And look at Kiwi. He, he's trying to figure out how to do uh, the Mushi Maniac world record. And mm -hmm. like, there's just so much stuff for that game that's a secret. It's real frustrating for him. Um, you know, from Japan. For Japanese strats? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and uh, Serrera, he's saying, what's your next goal? Yeah, that's 1.5 Ultra. Yeah. yeah, I'm on my stream. I'm trucking away for that 4.5 billion score. Uh, Pekechi, uh, he, yeah. he actually told me that uh, his PB on defaults was uh, 4.3 billion, but like, he did another score on non-defaults that's uh, 4.59 billion, mm -hmm. which he calculated by like uh, trying to figure out how much all these ambers are worth. And uh, yeah, that's a, that's a good goal to beat, I think. It's gonna, I think that's, uh, that's a little bit more realistic right now for me than the 5 billion. Oh, hey, Yamagashi's here. <laughs> that's <laughs> Yamagashi the who, uh, yeah, that's the guy who commented on me at, at GDQ, right? On the Japanese. Oh, yeah, 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 yes, yes. Yeah. Oh man, he was good. Yeah, all these all these great players are coming out, man. <laughs> yeah, it's a real honor. Uh, 
five minutes yeah. to go. Yeah, I should also mention like uh, the language barrier between the Japanese and Western communities. It, it's not really all that big a deal, I think. Mm -hmm. Like there's just so many Western players right now who are learning Japanese. Oh, like like good. Like yeah, I think the proportion of people learning Japanese in the Western shmup community is probably higher than any other gaming community out there. Like everybody's learning Japanese pretty much. <laughs> Did you hear that? Japanese people? <laughs> <laughs> oh, is it your first time you came to Japan? Uh, I've been going since 2011, almost every year. Every year? Yeah, almost every year. And uh, I actually lived here for like three months back oh. in 2015. Yeah. It's one of my biggest regrets is that back when I was living here, I didn't go to Avicen, watch WTN play some Donald Pachi. Oh, Avicen. <laughs> Man, I really wish I could have been there to watch it, but yeah, I just didn't like have the balls to like go there. Did you meet some super player when you come to come in <clears throat> Japan? Yeah, yeah, I have met WTN. WTN, yeah. Yeah, I, have, I said some stupid stuff in the past, then uh, I apologized to him for it in person. <laughs> And yeah, we're pretty cool with each other now. He's a great dude, actually. No, you guys are now friends. So. Yeah. I don't think. Sushi, you're like, okay, how do you think? This. Yeah. 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 <laughs> what do you think about? I love this man. <laughs> you love it. <Yeah. laughs> it's awesome. He's made it to Japan. This is this is pure Western culture right here. Yeah, I bring it. Yeah. <laughs> do you know why it's like people rob it? In the Western Shuraiba community? It's a secret for everybody. <laughs> it's a secret. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I, I have no idea. It's just to me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right, we have five minutes to go. Mm. Sorry about that. I'm a kind of bad at interviewing. Stop the sale. Go for yeah. Western players. Toy. Yeah. Yeah. Go for Western players. JLPT N1. Oh, yeah. I took the, J the N2 back in December. It's brutal. But uh, yeah, I guess I can take it again. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I gotta teach you. <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> what? Yeah. What is it? My favorite pull up run game. Yeah, Tatsu you know. Tatsu Jino. Yeah. What's it called? <laughs> Track Sun 2. Yeah. Yeah, I never like do a full run of it, but it's got some really great sections. I dig the first half of stage five. Stage five. Yeah, like that's the best thing to, to come out of that Pericles controversy from cheating. Let's give people like check out that that section. Like it's just so much fun to play. How many people from Japan want the best one? Well, I can't imagine. I on the you know the Yamagishi stream. There was like two thousand or three thousand people watching. You know, it's up every time in Japan. People are working at that time, but uh, I don't know about the streaming on the English HDQ. How many? I don't know how many people are watching that, but uh, I think people. Now Japanese people are interested in GDQ right now. Oh yeah, it's kind of growing culture. People. Yeah, our boy Kiwi is gonna be playing hopefully. Yeah, Kiwi, right? Yeah, <laughs> about seven, three thousand. Okay, we had we had one hundred fifty thousand. Yes, at our peak. yes, I can imagine. Yeah. That's so great. Yeah, it was incredible. Yes, yes. All the people working at Starry. Yeah. <laughs> we put 1.01 on the map. No, no one's no one's making fun of me for playing pre-order DLC anymore. <laughs> yeah. Okay. 
Yes, that's high. Yeah, people are all excited. Um, it seems some uh, people get interested to shoot them up. The yeah. non shoot up prayers. Definitely. Yeah. Because of yeah. you. We blew the doors wide open. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Come to shoot them up community anytime. Yeah. I, I had pillows to like help out my hands. I got history of hand problems, but mm -hmm. like playing with my hands resting on pillows, it makes it a lot easier. You bring your pillows? No, they're too bad. They're in the hotel. <laughs> oh, in the hotel? Yeah, I just took some pillows down from my hotel room. Okay. Yeah. Oh, in AGDQ? Yeah. Oh, that's good. I did the same thing at a stun fest. Like all, like Plasma, he was my roommate, he was looking at me. What the fuck are you doing taking pills with you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Power Rumi is my favorite yeah, game. Yeah, Power Rumi. And I love that game so much. How much more interested did people get in the game? Mm. <laughs> I can't see what I'm saying, but uh, many people did, I'd say. Oh, yeah, for, um, for, for a good place to start, check out the Electric Underground on YouTube. Yep. He's putting out tons of great content, and he's got a video specifically going over some great beginner games. I recommend uh, <clears throat> Dari Brockwell original for studying. Or, uh, or Mushi on Steam. Oh, yeah, Mushi on Steam, yeah. yeah. But that's why yeah. it's kind of easy. Also, Toho, a uh, fantastic Don Maku Festival. That's a good one. Don Maku Festival? Never yeah. heard of it. It's on Steam. I gotta check. <laughs> what is your favorite game other than Shoot 'em Up? F Zero GX. F Zero <laughs> yeah. <F> GX. <laughs> also, like Distance. <laughs> oh. Distance. Distance. Yeah. yeah, that's a Steam racing game. Oh, so you love the racing oh. game? Yeah, I love racing games. I can't hear of the racing game. Oh wow! Yeah, <laughs> wow. <laughs> he was playing Forza. Wow! All the day. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> he robs a car. Yeah. Wow! Man, that's amazing. <laughs> okay, it's already for. It's already forty-five minutes. All right. They have something to say at the. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah, thanks everybody <laughs> for coming out to watch. <laughs> yeah, everyone's here. Yeah, thanks a ton for Shutaro for having me here, man. Man, you're such great people. Uh, it feels amazing being out here. Yeah. <laughs> He's still excited. Okay. Okay, guys. Thank yeah. you for coming. Yeah. Um, have a good time in Japan. And check out my Twitch channel. Oh, so that's not Twitch. <laughs> You're good. Yeah, check out. You're playing 1.5, right? Yeah. Ghost of Fist 2 on Twitch. Okay. Yep. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Subscribe. 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 <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, that's it for today. See you guys. Yeah. See yeah. you. Yeah, that's a good second. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, everybody. Bye bye. Bye bye.